Hey, what is going on guys? It's Starshay and welcome back to another video on the channel. Today we're going to be having a look at how to unlock Haldir's unique equipment in Lord of the Rings Rise to War. So hope you guys do enjoy this video and if you do, please do drop a like, comment and subscribe to the channel. And don't forget to turn on post notifications. You guys can also become a channel member by clicking that join button down below. Anyway, let's get straight into the video. Okay guys, so let's go and have a look at my Haldir. So Right now he's level 25 because I haven't really leveled him up this season because I've been using uh, Gimli, Theoden, uh, Eowyn and I finally got Galadriel to R5. So Haldir has been a bit on the side, you know, he's kind of been benched for the season but he's still a very good commander and if I go back to playing like an Elvish faction like Lord Lorien or Linden, I will definitely be giving him a try once again. So yeah, he's only level 25 but I did just get him to R10 today. So that's pretty great. Anyway, let's go have a look at his unique and just see, you know, uh, what exactly he has. So, March Warden's outfit, okay, only for Haldir, yeah. And at level 1, it gives plus 10 might, plus 8 focus, plus 6 speed. You know, that's pretty good because uh, Haldir is one of those commanders that is not, you know, really focused on just one stat. You know, upping everything seems to work out pretty well with him. And it gives army HP to elves plus 1. Nice. The ability Warden of the Forest is Alves Unis Gate Initiative. Okay, nice. And defense plus five when battling on woodlands. Okay. So basically, you always want to be fighting on wood tiles with him because your elvish units will all gain some defense depending on, you know, if this is strengthened and refined. And they will gain initiative, which means they'll be able to attack first every round. So how to unlock the March Warden's outfit? Well, you need to do protecting Lorien. So use Hel Haldir's army to defeat 5,000 orc units. So you can either attack orc units through combat, like uh, PvP, or you can just attack tiles like I'm doing right now, and hopefully hit a tile with a commander that has a bunch of orc units on it. Then forest trolls use Haldir's army to obtain 100,000 experience in mock battles. So that's pretty simple. You just go mock on a 300 tile, and that's like two levels, and you're done. And then for the old alliance, complete the unique task of Haldir. Okay. Let's, let's see if we can actually do that today. Oh, okay, so this is at Helm's Deep. Okay, obviously it's from the it's a reference to the movie, you know, where they where Helder comes and helps everybody. So let's reset that. And okay, what army do we want to use? Is the question. I would use Eagles, but I haven't outfitted him skill wise for beasts. Like, he's got Guide, he's got Galadrim, he's got Shield Training, and I was just upping on their squad. I did not equip him for B. So I'm gonna go Master Throwers, Dale Watchmen, and some Iron Warriors as a front line. So let's do that and let's go to I don't know 750 I guess. Yeah 750 because we have these skills like this is gonna you know up our range damage by a ton. This is gonna make our range units take le less damage. Guide will up all the damage for all our units so you know that's pretty good. Uh, let's see what about our Dale Oh, can I not click on them? There we go. Dale Watchmen, uh, when battling on Structure Land, and okay, yeah, so we want to have a lot less of them. So let's go with like, let's just go with a thousand, okay? I think they're pretty decent, so. Eight, a damage 20 to 26, HP 30, uh, Master Throwers, uh, 9 to 29. Okay, so they're, they're more consistent damage. So I'll keep some of them, but we'll up our Master Throwers to two and a half thousand. And I think that should be good. So let's go and start this challenge. And we have skip battle play check because I'm not sitting through like 20 battles or however many there are. So yeah, we're just going to skip through them. He is only level 25. So I'm not sure if he's going to be able to actually complete the unique. Because yeah, I, I know when I had A1, I'm pretty sure she was a bit higher level than just 25. Let's see. Okay, we lost. We lost. Okay, we didn't lose too much that round. And what is our boss? The boss is. Okay, with how? What are these? With berserkers? How many? Three thousand berserkers. Okay. Damn, these are all level fifty armies. What the? How are we even doing as well as we are doing? Like what? What the heck? And he doesn't really get any healing. I used to have the pipe on him, but right now he doesn't have any accessory because I gave the the pipe to Galadriel. So yeah, sorry, Helder. Okay, we we have. I don't know if we have enough to do this. Honestly, let's hope. Let's hope. Come on, you can do it, Helder. You can do it. 
Yes, nice, completed. And we've done his unique talk, so that's great. Okay, so let's go back, go back, go over to Commander, go to Haldir, click over here. Okay, so for the old alliances one out of one, we just need to do forest trolls and protecting Lorien now. Right now I have him marching over to a tile over here and hoping that that is a orc tile. So the last one I attacked was actually a Lutz. Unfortunately, it had a bunch of Uruk archers, which are Urukai and cave trolls, which are trolls. But the one before that, uh, it was an Agzog and he had orcs. So he had trackers and he had stalkers, which are both orcs. And we got 2,250 kills done like that. So yeah. So we're going to be unlocking his unique equipment pretty soon. Not, maybe not today, because I'm just going to, well, actually I'll probably unlock him today, but later today, because I'm just going to go and hit a couple of tiles until I get protecting Larian done. Then I'll send uh, him over to where my Galadriel is. So I'll send him over to my tile, my 300 over here, and I'll mock battle him twice and get 100k XP. And then I will unlock Elder. so... Yeah, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna sh uh, wait. Like I could just cut right now and then come back when I actually do that and then show you the, the unlock. But I mean, you guys already can see what the equipment does. So you know that's that's the pretty that's the pretty important thing. You can see the stats. You can see the requirements to unlock it. So that's pretty much all you need. You guys need to know. Anyway, if you guys did enjoy this video, please do drop a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And don't forget to turn on this post notifications. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.